So at Popcorn Talk, we're huge fans of movies. One question that we've been asking everyone on the carpet is that if you guys had to point to one movie from either your, your past, your childhood, your career, anything like that, that really kick-started your interest in, uh, in films, what would it be? Oh, man. I would have to say Liar Liar. I love Jim Carrey, and that was uh, the first movie that I was like, oh my god, I want to do comedy for the rest of my life. Um, as far as favorite movies, it would be Harry Potter, but Jim Carrey's in uh, Liar Liar was the one that really, really propelled my career. Uh, so, I'm not sure, I feel like most people won't have this, but Snatch um, is my favorite. It's a Guy Ritchie movie, and I think when I saw Snatch, I really realized how fun a movie experience could be. Um, it's just from front to end, just so many fun cuts, so many fun characters, everything builds up to a big climax and yeah, I just, I, I, I remember watching that and going, I want to make something that fun. Right, definitely. Now what can you guys tell us about happiness that sets it apart from the other things we see in the film? So a lot of people say happiness is similar to something like Black Mirror, um, which definitely we tried to emulate, but uh, we, we have kind of a lighter spin to it, I guess. Uh, I love comedy, um, and I think that a little bit more optimism than Black Mirror, it doesn't gut punch you at the end. Um, but yeah, we, we, we really tried to do something, and I'll let Danielle speak to just her performance, but with the character that gets an app that's to control every emotion that they have. Um, I think it's such a fascinating thing that we're seeing more and more. There's a Kickstarter that just released with a thing that you wear around your neck and it makes you feel happy or sad or whatever you want to feel. And I think that as we get more and more technologically savvy, we're going to get more and more things that are controlling our emotions. And I think that's pushing us away from what we really want to be interested in doing, which is looking internally and maybe healthily looking at what we feel as opposed to trying to suppress it. So. Um, yeah. What do you think? No, I agree with all of that. I think it's humans feel. That's what sets us apart than a lot of other species. So just being able to work through that in a positive way and not just trying to suppress, just basically what Ryan said. So.